Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be talking about bankruptcies. Jeff Bezos selling billions of dollars worth of Amazon. What happened to the stock market and some people that have been doing the right thing by getting their vaccination and all of the boosters. Do you realize what I'm up to and I'm in line with what you believe? Please hit the like button, subscribe and ring the bell. I'm trying to dig myself out of YouTube jail. Okay, first, I want to talk about the bankruptcies because this was interesting to me. And I think it will be you too. Bankruptcy filing rise at 16.8%. Okay, I'm not going to bore you with all this. Here's what I want you to look at I want you to look at 2019 businesses that were going bankrupt 22,780. All right. 2020. Hey, it got a little better. Didn't something bad happen in 2020? All right, well, in 2021, it really got better. It was only 14,347. And then in 2022, as the stimmies were in full blown, you know, everything was hunky dory, 13,480. But right here in 2023, we've got 18,000. 926. That's a big jump up for, for bankruptcies. Okay. But the question is next year, when that number gets, let's say, to 24, or 25,000, can we look forward to some other kind of thing? You know, uh, it, it's very strange. So check this out. Uh, uh, bankruptcy filings, how they've risen, and what we have to look forward to. Total bankruptcy filing by chapter, chapter 7, right? 2019, 480,000 went down in 2020, went way down in 2021, even lower in 2020. Oh, we just had an uptick in 2023. So I'm curious to see what 2024 has to offer and what and how they're going to correct it. Now, speaking of businesses, let's look at the big business owner and what he's up to. Because uh, I didn't buy any Amazon stock as it was going up. It always looked expensive to me. But it's starting to look like it might be a decent short one day. Well, we're going to get into the charts in a minute. but he. Bezos to sell up to 50 million Amazon shares in the online retail and cloud services firm over the next one year. According to a, a filing on Friday, and we're going to look at the chart on Friday, but the security is worth $8.6 billion. What is going on? Do you think he's selling at the top? Do you think he is scaling out as uh, the wealthy do? And do you think he knew that things were going to go up, that he was going to have the best years of his life in 2020, 21, 22? Is there a reason he didn't sell then? Is there a reason he's building bunkers? Why does he know that we don't? So, guys, I, I wanted to show you that there's more there's much more i know i'm going kind of quick but i just want to touch i want to highlight some things for you because it's up to you to build your own conviction oh but before we go to the charts i have this uh nice looking lady on my charts because i wanted to measure some things but this is professor tracy smart military and aerospace medicine air vice marshal she's way up there and she is doing the right thing. She's getting her jabs regularly, and she wants to encourage everybody to do so. Uh, jab number six yesterday. This time, Moderna XBB 1.5. In case you don't know, we're in another major wave of COVID-19 hospitalization rates, the highest in 12 months. That's why you should all get jabbed, because it is so bad. If you haven't had the COVID or a vaccination in the last six months, then it's worth getting jabbed. So I went over to her page 
and this is actually her page and I'll scroll down and now yeah and uh, now it's in her page but it's on this next one and I wanted to see what has changed I'm gonna play this at the end of the video because it has to do with a little bit of history I wanted to show you some things that I picked up on there's the young lady again so I went back on her profile and I started looking at her previous pictures from 2022. The good lady's been vaccinating herself no matter what the cost. But I want to I want to draw a line right here. Let me get this out of the way. We're gonna do a little measuring. Right there. That's she's a pretty level headed lady back in 2022. And here it is after shot number five. She's so proud, got her sucker and a little mark on her left arm. And is her head, head tilted a little bit? I can't really tell, but that's what's going on here. She's okay, I'm not gonna say too much here. But let's go to this last picture. And let's draw us. Oh, this will work right here. Uh oh. Can I just get a line? Can I get a line? Okay. There we go. Now, whoa. I have to drop the Fibonacci on that one later. But uh, you see what I'm trying to show you? The charts aren't trying to work with me. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure this isn't how you're supposed to use them. What happened? What has happened? So that's enough of that. Uh, thank you for being here. And I will remove this young lady as she continues to do the right thing. And we will see the Amazon chart. Now, on the news of Bezos last Friday, the stock market, the stock jumped up 8%. And that is crazy. Guys, if you were unable to experience the wealth created by Amazon over, you know, let's go to the monthly. Wow. That is really incredible. Uh, we could return to here and hopefully it'll create a nice little fair value gap there and we'll be able to zoom down as it trades below the 200 and we'll be able to create wealth of our own on the way down because I was not fortunate enough to get on this guys like I said before the rich don't tell you what to do but they do leave clues and I want to tell everybody that Stacy's father that just had the quadruple heart bypass surgery is doing very well thank you for your prayers uh, it was an answer to prayer he can already breathe better so cool. And I had some more. I'm going to put it in another video about some things that the WHO is coming out and saying that we all need to pay attention to. And there's going to be a little history lesson behind it of what happened back in the 1930s in Germany. And uh, the speech sounds a lot the same, but this is uh, the second time I've done this video because the first one got messed up. And this is all new to me, all the old stream yard and all this. So bear with me and have an awesome awesome day. Later.